YouTube this is Mike back for another video uh, today's video is I'm gonna show you uh, I seen a couple of comments people talk about the new blower I have which is a uh, cobalt I got it from Home Depot for I think it's $1.99 so I'll go ahead and show you check that out like I said I haven't did a video in a couple weeks like I said on the previous videos I've been doing full-time mobile detailing so I've been super busy but I think I'm eventually oh, sorry I think eventually I think eventually I'm gonna start uh I'm going to start doing detailed vlogs more and show what I'm doing out through the day while I'm detailing and stuff like that. And uh, I've been doing a lot more paint corrections and stuff like that. And I've been super busy, man. Just busy. So uh, let me go over and show you what I got. So the new blower is it's a Cobalt. The Cobalt 800 V Max. Like I said, and it comes. Like I said, it comes with the front thing right there. But I don't use it because I'm blowing off cars. But you can put it on there. I can show you guys if you want to. Might as well show what it looks like with the thing on. So this is I don't need to put it on because I'm blowing the car off. You're sitting, there, sitting, there doing, you're sitting there holding it back away from the cars. So what I do is you like this. This you just easy to blow it off. Just blow it off. And uh, yeah, it's 630 CMF. I mean CFM, sorry, 140 miles per hour. So it has a lot of power. And like I said, it has regular rocket. Lock with no hands, a little lock, and also there's an extra fast, which is a turbo. So, you know, what I mean, you can get going about hit that turbo. And go, eh. I'm just kidding, <laughs> but anyways, you can just hit that, it makes a lot of water off 10 times faster, like I said. And it helps a lot. Like, if you're, if you're mobile detailing out in the sun, you know, what I mean, out in the, this weather, it's easy to blow out jams, tires, blows the car off real quick, and everything like that. It saves you a lot more time before those water starts start cooking on the paint. You know, let me come up with the charger. Like I said, it lasts about, like, I can get three cars out before I charge it, which that's good enough, you know what I mean? Like, even when I blow one car off, if I just, I just plug it in after I blow one car off and just charge it back, it back up. It takes, like, 15 minutes. Not long at all. So, that, so then the other thing I use, sorry, guys, I was a little confused. And also, too, but I, I got this new uh, Car Pro. It's a new chamois. It helps a lot. You can get about two cars off with it. Right here. This is awesome. I now just have it have it hanging in my hand so when I get done it dries off. Well this is awesome, especially in the summer too. Because in summer you're gonna have to have a little bit of a chamois or something like that to wipe off the windows for a streak up of water. And this you just throw it on top of the whole car, it takes the water right off quick, man. It, it's an awesome thing. I think it's like twenty seven dollars. You can go to sky's the limit, car pro car pro dash usa.com. This is sky the limit. It's a base out of Florida. Helps you out a lot. Also, too, like I said, I can show you a couple new updates on the products I use. Like I said, I, I, I used to still use PSI products, which in the previous video you can show what products I use. But for glass cleaner, I've been using a lot is because a lot of the high end, I, I detail a lot of high end cars, so a lot of high end, I just use the high end products, which is this Car Pro Clarifies glass cleaner. I got me a gallon of that. I think it runs about $59 for a gallon. I use a uh, car pro reset for the soap for my coatings and stuff like that. So when I do coatings, I can do maintenance washes. I have that. Then I have car pro apparel, which I think this is about 29. That's, that's about 30 bucks for a liter, 30 bucks for a liter. It's a little expensive, but the products I use, you know what I mean, for the cars. And, and this is a, uh, I'm using this for the coating next week. It has a felled coating. It's a Car Pro Essence. It's a uh, stream gloss enhancer hybrid energy. You can use this on top of coatings. You can prime. It's a prime surface. So what do you do if like so? If you do a coating, if you polish it, 
do a two step you can hit this with a three step it does have fillers in it so you want to make sure you always get the scratches out that's why you want to do it once uh, do a two step first before you apply this then put this on the car before you apply the coating and it'll keep you from scratching the coating with the rags or anything like that it, it kind of helps lay the coating on like i said it's pretty good stuff and then i got car pro essence plus which this is like a more top coat abrasive this you put us on you do this repairs nano coating this, this is repair like car pro coatings at the end if they fail a little bit not not hydrophobic you can use this on top of a coating to polish it back out and make it look good good stuff then other car pro i use multi-x which that's my favorite and so it's a good awesome degreaser for interior exterior and dilute it i think it runs about like 100 bucks a gallon 89 dollars a gallon then for my interiors i use car pro inside which that's about 80 bucks a gallon But yeah, so like I said, I've been I've been using I still use PSI products like so, normally based. I still use that. I still use their chemicals. They're awesome chemicals, and you know I mean if you can't afford the Car Pro, still PSI is one of the top chemicals I still use. But I do use a lot of Car Pro. Like I said, these are the gallons I got. I got I'm gonna get the gallon. I'm gonna get a couple gallons of the reset, and then uh, reload, which is the sealant for the insider. That insider stuff, awesome. Man. And those the Multi X and the glass cleaner is real good. This is Insider. It's uh, all purpose for leather. It dedicates le leather and car interior cleaner. And it leaves, it's a, it pervades leather strength, durability, and improves. This is good for, it's real good for leather seats and everything like that. It cleans it, but also leaves a nice finish. You know, we're not greasy, slimy. It leaves a nice finish. Then, you know, for my sealants, I use Car Pro Reload. You know, I, mean, I use that for my sealants. Stuff like that. For six, you get like six months out of it. I mean, there's another little closet, little reload bottle. Then I got this little sample. I've been trying this out right now. It's a Car Pro Elixir. It's a high gloss, quick detailer. I've been trying this out. It's a little sample. I always try them out. You can go on Car Pro. You can go on CarProUSA.com and get samples and try them all out before you buy it. And that's what I use. And it's awesome stuff. So I'm gonna definitely get that next. But yeah, you see, I got. Like I say, guys, I kind of went to a different product, which, I, like I said, I still use PSI stuff like that but i still love my uh the reset soap is real good it's highly concentrated and used about two caps in a little three gallon bucket and then this this is and this is a, a pearl which is a water-based silicone oxidated coat you use it for interior plastics and everything like that and you also can dilute that with some water in it like one of one i use it straight on the tires and this is kind of showing you guys it's kind of showing you guys the update they're not the wash mitts i use is a microfiber madness they're uh microfiber madness they're awesome you know i mean it keeps you from taking care of that paint and stuff like that what else i got i still use bead maker i still use you know what i mean which is this right here it's ceramic quick ceramic detailer spray i use on every car i detail i put that on over it over any kind of coating just anything like that then like i said reload so using the same setup got me a little air compressor which i'm getting a little pancake compressor eventually i mean the pancake one just works a lot better and that's not too big my, my generator don't really my generator don't really power that uh that coating and i do got a ladder you can see a stool i mean i got this i got the little stool and also got a canopy which is from walmart for 79 dollars it's a 10 by 10 which if you're a mobile detailing, I do highly recommend a canopy, especially I'm in Florida and it gets like 95 degrees and out in that sun, you can't be out there no more than two to three hours. You're out there just dying. So let, I've been, I use a canopy, you know what I mean? And it's 10 by 10, $79 at Walmart. And then what I use for the, for don't, I'm about to do some Amazon, which are weights you put on the end of the bottom legs. See them back there, you put them on the, you put them in the leg, there's a little groove where you, you put the legs at. I got I got eight of them and they're like seven pounds a piece, so fourteen pounds on each. I said fourteen pounds on each uh, leg, so it holds it down good for the wind. In this case, the wind blows. If the wind blows too bad, I won't put it out. But like I said, if you can afford and if you like Car Pro, I do highly recommend Car Pro. You know what I mean? It's, it's awesome stuff. Like I said, it's S. I can't wait to try this next week. I got a coating. This is for a top coat. It's non-abrasive. Like I said, and it's for, it repairs nano coatings, not for use for use on coating vehicles. So this one here, X, I mean, SN Plus is for coatings only. 
I want to kind of say this over again, kind of if you understand. This is a, this has a two cut and ten gloss, but it does have fillers. But if you do a two step, do a compound, do a polish, and they hit this with another polish, I'm telling you the cars will come out good, and glossy. I mean, and this protects you from scratching that, so it leaves a little. You you don't have to wipe this off. You can put coatings over this. It's awesome stuff. Like usually use a usually use a uh, IPA to wipe off. You don't have with this. You can put a coating right over this stuff. I'm pretty positive if you can. I mean, I think that's what it is, yeah. But yeah, like I said, I use a lot of CarPro now. CarPro is a good product. Coatings. I mean, that's the only coating I use is a CarPro UK at the moment. There's different levels to CarPro, but you got to be certified to get CarPro Professional, CarPro Finest, which that's my end goal to get a... Eventually, I'm going to get a shop and start doing coatings like that. Got me a new little light, too, if I want to do coatings and paint corrections. Got it from my local tool guy. It's 400 it's 400, uh, I think. But it's, it's pretty good. It's bright, you know what I mean? I get the coating knocked out with it. Bam, bam. And you always want to stay uh, sanitized there. I always spray this in the car before I get in, before I do the interior. Then I spray it on the outside, and I spray it inside when I get done with it, just to, for the customers to be uh, safe, you know what I mean? Just keep it safe, keep it protected, keep it uh, sanitized. So I got my coating bag, which I take, I'll take that inside. I'll never leave my polishers and stuff inside. Still the same setup. So yeah, guys, this is a little update video. Uh, I'm gonna start doing more videos. Like I said before, I've been having a little sinus problems and stuff like that, so I've been feeling good too for my head. So I'm gonna get, but I'm gonna go definitely get back doing videos. I'm gonna do detail vlogs while I'm detailing out all day because I'm out there every day detailing, and I have a lot of information for you guys I can provide and actually show what mobile detailer does. So I'm actually in the detailing field, and I'm not just gonna do videos to tell you how to detail. I'm gonna show you what I do and the best way you can take it how it is. So like I said, every every business gonna be different, every area is gonna be different, and the prices gonna be different. Like people asking for prices, my prices are different than other areas. You know what I mean? Can't go off base my prices. My little mask too. No, I'm everywhere, but my little mask I wear protect myself from a. Uh, like I said, if you're doing a lot of coatings and stuff like that and compounding, you want to wear a mask because you're breathing in the chemicals. Man, I've been I've been detailing for a long time and the chemicals, I think I'm supposed to off my sinuses in my head because the chemicals are getting to me. Every time I have my detail, I feel like my head's hurting and things like that. So I'm trying to just get everything taken care of, stay protected, stay safe and stuff like that. And I got my, got my, got my pole shirt. Let me ask my rotary. I don't really use rotary that much. If I have to do a little wet sand, I do. Stuff like that. I still use the same, I use Meguiar's 110, you know. I still use, I use Just Car and stuff like that. All the coatings back there. All right, guys, that's today's little video. Short little seven minute video, six minute video. But remember, like and subscribe and hit the bell notification. And I promise you, more videos on the way and some good content. I'm gonna do some daily vlogs every, at least three days, at least three times a week. Daily vlogs of me mobile detail. I'll detail through all the week and I'll cut the videos up and edit them and show what I do every weekend. I'll work Monday through Saturday. Usually I take off Monday and Sunday, sometimes Saturdays. I mean, you gotta take a break. So I was working. Because when I was working full time at Porsche, I was working full time at Porsche detailing 30 to 50 cars of, you know what I mean, a month on top of weekends eating my own business. It was getting a lot. So you gotta take breaks. Always take a break. Because now you just get worn out, wear yourself out, and you won't enjoy it. Because I actually enjoy what I do. Yeah, it's still the same setup. I think eventually you know, I still got a new tank I got. So it's still the same deck setup, man. Just, but remember, you guys out there detailing, stay safe. Use hand sanitizer. Wear a mask. I even got me a little mask with my logo on it. So yeah, I bought that. I think seven bucks a piece. A little mask. Got some new shirts. I'm going to start selling some shirts eventually. But I don't know. I mean, if you guys want to wear my shirts, I'll sell them and make them. Then give me a hat. But yeah all right guys now again this time i'm really off the phone so remember like and subscribe hit the bell notification on the bottom and i'll be back with some more videos go with one with detailing out peace